Once upon a time in the countryside, there was a really big house. It was empty and nobody lived in the house apart from Michael the Mouse. Michael the Mouse lived in this massive big house with lots of rooms and he used to have so much fun playing in all the bedrooms. But one day, he'd heard about an old lady that had bought the house. She decided she was going to move in, but she didn't want a mouse to live in the little hole in the floorboards. Michael thought, what am I going to do? He decided to hide in one of the bedrooms. And suddenly, the door opened and the old lady came in with three ferocious cats. These cats were the best cats in the world at catching mice. Michael thought, oh no, what am I going to do? These cats could catch me and if they catch me, they'll throw me out of the house and I won't be able to live here anymore. He turned his back on the cats and then he ran upstairs and went into one of the bedrooms. Now you'll know which one Michael is because there's a big M on the back for Michael. These three cats decided we need to come up with a plan how to catch the mouse. So this cat, he did something really sneaky. He decided he was going to go into Michael's hole and wait for Michael to come back. He went inside like this and went all the way in. But once he got in there, he found this. It was a note. And the note said, gone to Disneyland. The cat said, I know that Michael the mouse is doing a trick and he hasn't gone to Disneyland. He's hiding. So the cat stayed in the hole. Now you'll know which this cat is. This cat's called Marmalade. And you'll know it's Marmalade because there's a big M for Marmalade on, it, on the back. Now the other two cats, they heard a noise upstairs and they thought, oh, he could be in one of the bedrooms. So this cat went in the door on this side. Now this cat's called Marmite. You'll know which one is Marmite because there's a big M for Marmite. And Marmite went there. This cat is called Margarine. And Margarine, you'll know which one Margarine is because there's a big M for Margarine. He went in this side. When they got in the room, the cats were about to chase the mouse. Now, don't forget, we've got Marmalade because of the big M. We've got Marmite because of the big M. Michael the mouse in the middle. You'll know which one Michael is because he's got a M on his back. And this one over here is Margarine because he's got a big M on his back. Well, they all started to chase each other. The cats were chasing the mouse. The mouse was chasing the cats. They ran really fast. That fast. Even I didn't know which Michael was. Oh, no. We're going to have to try and find Michael to make sure he's safe. Uh, which one do you think Michael is? This one? This one? What about that one? In the middle? You think this is Michael? Let's have a look. Give Michael a big wave. We found Marmite. We found Marmite. But you go over there. You can stay down there. Oh no. Margarine started chasing Michael. This is it. We need to make sure Michael is safe. Which one is Michael? This one or that one? No, that's this one. That's that one. Do you want that one or this one? That one. Do you think this is Michael? Oh no, let's have a look. Hey, you found margarine, that's margarine. That means Michael is over here and we've got him and he's nice and safe. Give him a big, big clap. We found marmalade. Marmalade, what are you doing here? Marmalade, you... Hang on. If this is marmalade, who's in the house? You think Michael's got in the house? How's he got in the house? By magic. If Michael is in the house, that means he's safe and he'll never ever have to leave the house and he can stay and play with all the cats. Let's see, is it Michael for a big, big clap? 
give Michael the mouse a big, big clap. That means he can stay in the house forever and ever. Once upon a time, there was a princess who lived in a big castle. She had a crown with a big jewel on the top. She kept it under this cloth to keep it nice and clean. But she went out to McDonald's to buy some chicken nuggets. And when she went to get her chicken nuggets, a naughty man decided to come in and do a trick with the jewel on top of the crown. He removed the blanket like this. He saw the jewel. He pulled the jewel off using all his muscles and decided he was going to hide the jewel and she wouldn't know where it is. He looked around and he found this safe. He thought, I know, I'll hide it in the safe and she'll never find it. The naughty man, he put the jewel inside just like this. Once it was inside, he closed it shut. He put it down on the table and he covered up the crown so she wouldn't know straight away the jewel had gone. When she came back, she went over to the safe. She thought, I didn't leave that safe there. And when she looked inside, she couldn't see anything. It was empty. Ah, maybe she needs to look in the other side. Let's have a look. Let's see. Oh, there's nothing there either. The jewel has disappeared. Where could it be? Let me try the other side again. No, it's not there. The jewel has gone. She thought, I wonder why the safe was there when there's nothing inside it. Now we know that the naughty man put the jewel inside. We know it's not here because we can see, and we know it's not there because we can see. Sorry? No, I'm not tipping it up. No, that's cheating. No, it's not there, and I won't tip it, because if you tip it, that's called cheating. And it's not there either. I honestly do not know where the jewel could be. There's, there's not in this side. No, I didn't tip it. Have a look. There you... Open them both together. No, I can't do that. You want me to? Okay, if you open them both together, you will see the jewel really has disappeared. And nobody knows where it is. Where do you think the jewel could be? Back on the crown? Shall we have a look? Let's have a look. If it's back on the crown, we can give a big, big clap for the princess. Let's see. Give the princess a... Oh no, the jewel's gone. The princess was so upset because that was her favorite crown. We thought, what could we do? Hang on. Can you lot all help me? Can you all do the magic? Look, I'll cover it up like this. We'll grab the magic wand. Everyone put your hands in the sky, wiggle your fingers. And after three, we all say the magic words, abracadabra. Are we ready? Here we go, wiggle them fingers. After three, one, two, three, abracadabra. Let's see if you are all magic. If it's come back on the top, massive big clap. Let's have a look. Give yourselves a big, big clap. That means the princess has got her crown back, the jewel is on the top, and the naughty man can't do any more tricks on her. Right, Sam, what you been up to? Football. You've been playing football. You scored a hundred goals. Whoa! Who who did you score the goals against? The birds. What do you mean you scored against the birds? You chased them off first, and then you scored the goal. 
Oh, well, that's a bit easy if there's nobody in the goals to score. Oh, I tell you what. And you've been eating cake. Yeah. What, like a little piece of cake? A hundred cakes! Whoa! You can't eat a hundred cakes. You'll all be fat. And you've been doing some schoolwork. Oh, well, that's okay. As long as you've been doing some schoolwork. Well, what are you going to do for the boys and girls today? Have you? You've got some pictures of your favourite food. Whoa, what are they? The boys and girls have to guess. Oh, hey, this could be fun. We've got some pictures here of his favourite food. You've got to guess what his favourite food is. Get ready. Here we go. Can anybody guess what's this? A banana. Well done. Hey, put your hands up if you like bananas. Whoa, you all like bananas? Wow. Hey, Sam. Do you like bananas? Wait, no? You don't like bananas? You said these were your favourites. Uh, I'll put the banana here. I thought that they were his favourites. Uh, oh, what's this? Carrots. Well done. Hey, put your hand up if you like carrots. Whoa, that is great. I love carrots. Sam, you must like carrots. Wait, no? You don't like it? You said they were your favourites. I'll put it over here. Uh, let's find another one. What's this? An egg. Hey, put your hand up if you like eggs. Oh, <laughs> I like eggs. Sam, you must like eggs. Wait, no! Yeah, I don't believe him today. You said they were your favourite foods. And who knows what this is? An apple. Well done. Put your hand up if you like apples. Oh, well done. Put your hand up if you like apples with worms in. Eh, disgusting. Do you like apples? Wait, no! I don't believe this. He said they were his favourites. I'll put that there. I've only got one left. Does anybody know what this is? A bone. Who likes bones? Yeah. We don't like bones. Hey, Sam, do you like bones? Get off it. Get you can't have the bone yet, you haven't done your magic. Hey, I've had an idea. What I'll do is I'll put the bone here, I'll mix them all together, and Sam has to find the bone by magic. Do you think you can do this? You can. Right, let's give it a go. You put your head down there. I'm going to mix them all up so you can't see. And then... Sorry? Ha Is he peeping? If he peeps, you have to tell me. He can be very naughty sometimes. What we'll do is we'll... Sorry? I'll put my hand here. If I put my hand there, I'll be able to see if he's cheating. I, I, <coughs> you are so naughty. Right, that is it. Put that on there, over the top, and I'll cover your eyes up. <laughs> now he can't see. Let's mix them up really quickly like this. Done it. Now, you need the magic wand. Uh, okay then, here's the magic wand. You hold that. Now what are you going to... Hey! Stop hitting me! Oh, you couldn't see. Uh, shall I let him hold the wand again? Shall I? Okay then, because you lot said it's okay. You hold on to that. Uh, stop it! That is it! You're not having that magic wand. Uh, I'm going to put them in your mouth one at a time. You've got to guess which one is the bone. If you get it right, then we'll know your magic, okay? Here we go. First one in your mouth. Sam, is that the bone? <laughs> Why did you spit that one out? It's not the bone. It... Oh, it's a banana. Hey, he's doing ever so well. That's not the bone. Let's try another one. Put that in your mouth. Sam, is that... The bone. <laughs> what did you spit that one out for? It's not the bone. Uh, it's the carrot. Hey, he's doing a good job at this. Let's try another one. That in your mouth. Sam, hit. Ow, stop that. It. Stop that. It. Ow, get off it. Why won't you let go of this one? You think it's the bone? Well, if it's a bone and he has found it, he really is magic. We give him a big, big clap. Let's see. 
Give him a big, big clap. Wow! Sammy really are magic. Oh, boys and girls, I'm afraid it's time for Sam to go just for now. So put your hand in the sky. Give a big wave and say, see you later, Sam. Say, see you later, everybody.